Let us try to understand the concept of a port mapping in Docker containers. What port mapping essentially means is this. Say I have a port X on my host operating system and a port Y on my Docker container. Mapping port X to port Y would mean that whatever request my host operating system receives on port number X will be forwarded to the Docker container on port number Y. To understand this more in depth, let us try to take the help of a few examples. Suppose I have a Docker container which is running the image of a Nginx web server. If I go out here and say docker ps, I can see that I have a container running the Nginx image. And here I can see the ports that this container is making use of. So um, suppose I would now say curl localhost. For those who don't know, curl is a utility used to communicate with the URLs. And in this case, all I'm trying to do is send a get request to the localhost URL. I would expect that since my Nginx is running and using port number 80, I should get a valid response. However, I see that connection to localhost on port number 80 was refused. Now, why does this happen? This happens because I am trying to communicate with the, po the, the port number 80 on my local machine. However, this port number 80 here is inside the Docker container and the port number 80 in my machine is in no way linked to the port number 80 of the Docker container. Well, and how do we go about resolving this? Well, it's much more simpler than we'd expect. We stop this running container and the next time that we ask Docker to run the Nginx image, we simply tell Docker that please do map the, a certain port number in this case I, I could pick anything but for the sake of this example I would pick port number 8080. Please map the port number 8080 from my local machine to port number 80 in the docker container so that any request that comes to localhost 8080 or to the IP address of my host operating system at the port 8080 is forwarded to port 80 in the docker container which is running this nginx image when i hit enter i see that my container has started again if i say docker ps and here i see a change from what we had above here it just said 8080 but here it says it in a different format which signifies that any request coming to port number 8080 will be transferred to port number 80 in this container so what happens when I say curl localhost? Well, it's not gonna work because my port 80 is not mapped to port 80 on the Docker container. But when I say curl localhost 8080, I indeed see this response. And I can see that logs are getting generated on the Nginx web server. And this is so simple, like it just takes a couple of words to do it. But this is such a powerful Docker feature. And that will be it for this time. We took a very simple but a very effective example to understand port mapping in Docker containers. What do you guys think about this feature of Docker? Do tell me in the comments below. And if you find the content of the video helpful, do hit the like button. If you, if you like the content of my channel and find it helpful, do click subscribe. And like always, thanks a lot for watching.